Hello everyone, I'm Revolutionary Leader Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here in Kaiserreich playing as a left KMT. Currently, we are in a war against the Shangqing Tianguo Chinese nation. Um, and we have some volunteers who are doing something to the enemy, which probably doesn't actually help us whatsoever, but anyways. We have 58 army XP. The United States has fallen into civil war, and I guess we could talk about this first. Now, someone, one of my commenters, subscribers, left a comment saying that I should support the Pacific States of America. Well, I can't do that. We're not really the same ideology, and I could send guns to the CSA, but uh, I'm a little bit out of guns right now, so can't really help the PSA. I don't have guns to help the CSA, so, and America's basically on fire, you know, and they have fire bombings, you know, just, just typical American things. Um, honestly, it really looks like the American Union state might win. I'm really surprised Canada didn't take New England. So that's probably going to follow the CSA. Huey Long has been doing really well, and the Pacific states aren't doing bad either. Now, I had another someone, another someone, another person, say that I should request some lend from maybe some syndicalists, radical socialist governments. But, um, all these enemy nations, enemy nations, all these potentially friendly nations... Well, they don't accept. They, 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 they say no. Coming to France, how about you? Guns? Can I have guns, please? No. Uh, they have a surplus of support equipment? No, they don't like us that much. Uh, obviously not the German Empire. The Soviet Russia people? They can't. They won't let us do that. How about the Republic of Italy? The Socialist Republic of Italy? No. Hmm. I now have the big sad. The commune over here? They already gave us a division, which is nice, but, um, no, fuel, no, okay, Art artillery, no, okay, and how about some infantry equipment, no, okay, so yeah, that, I mean, that was actually a really smart idea, I didn't realize that we could request land lease, and we're actually really the exact same ideology, but whatever, oh, how about you guys, Liang Guang's people's government, yes, no, uh, infantry equipment, no, okay, well, whatever, I mean, that is our production. They always said no. So really, we're going to wait here and make sure that we have enough artillery as well as infantry equipment. But now we have an extra research slot. I love the research. Ooh, that looks pretty good. Reconcile KMT and Sichuan. Extra military research coordination. That looks pretty good. Yunnan. Reorganized nationalist cells. Oh, actually, let's do this one. I need the infantry equipment quickly. So, as more of China is liberated from the warlords, the KMT structure as an underground party becomes pointless. We need loyal and competent party members to help administer the governments of the prefectures, and these local party members are the ideal candidates. Party cells in controlled regions should be reorganized into regional party di uh, directorates until a more formalized government is established and thank god we've got another research slot oh my goodness uh raise a cap even though we're not even near the cap yet but whatever that's okay so now we're gonna hold on uh romania joined the belgrade pact we're gonna focus really hard and in, an in intense focus up oh, there goes oh there goes spain on guns producing as many guns as possible foundation of the belgrade pact 1937 dutch elections a lot of things are going on right now we could get some more war support war support is going okay right now I could integrate some provinces. I probably want to integrate the Zhejiang province. Um, yeah, right here. Instead of the Zhangzi province, which is down here. So this has two, almost 3 million. Well, you guys have almost 10, roughly 10 million guys. That's a lot of guys. I prefer 10 over that many, but whatever. I'd like to take Anhui. But we need to control Huai Si. Huai Si, huh? Alright then. Oh, we need that so the fall oh well there goes Madrid. Holy cow, that's fast. 0.98 political power a day. If I were to attack though, I would definitely have to do it somewhere strategic. Somewhere very, very strategic. You know, I'm gonna move you down here. Since I'm not gonna attack across the line here, give me half of you guys to help balance that out a little bit more. Because I want to make sure we attack mostly in the western portion of our front with the strongest divisions. Militia will easily be able to defend here. No, you come over there. I want you over here, too. Good. Yeah, send that militia division over. Because those guys are pretty weak. Lin Biao. Oh, an infantry expert. Awesome. Love it. Good. I didn't realize he already had that. 
Uh, the Beijing government's pretty big. Maklik is not having a good time. Mongolia, though, really isn't having a good time. We have the Kamul Khanate, East Turkestan, Soviet Russia, uh, Socialist Republic of Ukraine fighting the Reichs Pact, and, of course, Spain is having a good time. American Union States having a good time. Uh, some people are having good times. Some people. Good, good, good. I'll probably attack this tile just because militia. Oh, they're trying to mobilize or get more divisions there. Peru declared war in Ecuador. So be it, so be it. Um, deficits still not looking good. I don't like that. Really, really don't like that. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and... I could integrate... Yeah, we might as well integrate it now. I could probably use the manpower. Good. Now, this is probably a bad idea. But let's try it. <coughs> Excuse me. So, we're winning so far. So far, hopefully. 75 goes up to 76. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. <coughs> Alright. <coughs> not bad. 120 combat with... Actually, yeah, that's not, that's not terrible. Hopefully these guys can win, keep it up. Destroy that militia division. That's probably the most important thing you could do. Come on. Uh, we're slowly, slowly but surely, hopefully going to win. Ooh, reorganize national cells. Great. More war support, political power, infantry equipment. More political power and civilian fac factory, or... Yeah, civilian factory. Ooh. <clears throat> This only takes 28 days. Sure. The Central China Railroad, Railroad, a local name for the new lines that connect Zhejiang to the interior, are critical for our supply lines in this early period of the revolution. Up until now, the railway has operated according to the demands of foreign capital, but we can run it more efficiently or effective, efficiently, and with better purposes ourselves. Absolutely. Go ahead and integrate that province too. Oh, we get a lot less political power because of that. Whatever, that's okay. Oh, you're attacking with... Oh, you know what? You stop attacking. Send the infantry in there, too. S attack with a stronger division here. Yeah. I think the, the Indian division is here, too, which is good. Good. Push him back. Push him back. We should win that battle. We have a tiny, tiny surplus of artillery. And we have a small, a, grow, a shrinking deficit of guns for now until this battle finishes, in which we will have another large deficit. God dang it, they threw another division in here. Come on, man. Come on, that's not cool. That's really not cool. But hopefully we can still win. Their militia, they haven't really been in here yet. We might attack this area. Attacking like this is going to be such a pain in the butt, which means we need to get as much artillery as possible, because I can throw that on as support battalions. Indian division, could you please help attack this tile? It's much more important than anything else here. Please. Oh, Saudi Arabia joined the Cairo Pact, so be it. Alright, yep. Yeah, these guys are still just kind of hanging out. Most Zambique Bush War, Middle Africa declared war in Portugal, so be it. Why don't they attack me? Like, come on, man. Good. Throw you in there, even though I'm not going to let you move. Good, we got rid of the militia division. Now we're stuck with just the infantry. Oh, the infantry. Oh, that division's almost gone. They're almost completely gone. Two, less than two organization? Yeah, get out of here. You garbage. Get out of here. We should, be, we should win a little bit faster than this, but obviously we're not. Whatever. So be it. Oh, they threw the militia division back in there. God dang it. And it's come back. You know what? Hold. It's, it's, oh, colonial reform in Africa. Okay, middle Africa. Go ahead and hold. That was kind of a waste of time. I mean, pretty much. Cool. Uh, Sichuan, Yunnan, Unite Southern China. I'd like that. But we can't do that. Let's do this, though. 50 days. Our alliances with the pro-KMT warlords will be ineffective if we do not cooperate to some extent. By sharing and mandating technical specifications with these armies, we can make sure that our forces and logistics will be able to operate anywhere that they need us to or that we need them to. Good. Now, that gave us quite a bit more army XP, which is nice. 20 military... 20 factories, a deficit of about 3,200 guns, but artillery is doing slightly better. Now, I'm going to make sure that these guys, you're actually not bad, but most of the divisions I've been using are this type of division, which I need to throw on, how much support equipment do we have? A support equipment is not bad, actually. Recon gives you just barely any more attack, dispersed industry, nice. Engineers give you actually more attack and breakthrough than recon companies right now, but they have no recon themselves. 
I like the recon. Engineers. Mm, this, this could hurt us potentially do that. Yeah, it's probably not a good idea, but whatever. In time, I would put them on anyways. Go ahead and do some more research speed. Oh, we probably have a massive deficit. Actually, that's not a bad deficit of stuff. That ain't too bad. How about you guys? You need artillery. Which 12 artillery per division isn't great, but I'd rather put that on now and have everyone work towards that goal in time. So, all right, not bad. That does cost us quite a bit of army XP. So be it. P P Poland. Poland. Wow, Poland. Um, Kind of gutsy there, I see. Even though you are trying to attack the Ukrainians, this could be a weird alliance if Poland allies the Ukraine. That'd be really weird. Mexico joined the Third International. How many divisions does Poland have? Holy cow. 10 to 12. Germany has oh, maybe 100. You guys have up to 41, maybe. They'll win in the early stages, but they'll probably die off in the end. So be it. So be it. Good. Less than 3,000 gun deficit of, well, guns. Not bad, not bad. You guys are doing okay. I wish I could convert some of these divisions. I hate having so much militia here. Uh, trade places. That'd be good. I could attack here, actually. This might prove to be better to attack. Ooh, but you definitely need more supplies. We need guns, artillery pieces, support equipment. Uh, put you on medium. Put you Actually, yeah. Make sure we have enough reinforcements every going there first. That's absolutely the most important thing you could do. So get that, get that artillery. Get everything in there. And we will attack again once the Indians stop attacking. And then they restart attacking. That will be important. We sh actually might be able to win here with enough artillery pieces. I'm going to try... Oh, you have no... Oh, yeah. Some of you guys are not really good. Uh, they look okay, but then you realize what type of division they are, and then you're like, oh my gosh, no. Oh yeah, maybe I shouldn't even attack here. Holy cow. You guys, though. You are okay. You only have one artillery. Oh, there goes Serbian Republic. Piercing, soft attack, defense, fourth Balkan War. Cool, not bad. Could be worse. Alright, as soon as the Indian Division starts attacking, I will start attacking this tile as well. Give them just a little bit more time to get a little bit more resources. Uh, that Indian Division definitely needs more. There you go. Help them out, help them out, help them out. Force the attack. They should be able to win against these two enemy divisions. They should be able to win. But then again, I could be wrong. Come on. Now, these Indian Division... Indian divisions. There's only one division here. It might just scuttle away. I mean, obviously, it's not very strong. And they're dug in. God dang it. And they're entrenched. But they only have bat infantry battalions. I hope this Indian division, like, retires because I need my guys in the battle, please. A little bit more, please. Thank you. Come on. We're winning so far, which is great. But let's see if it actually stays that way. Ottoman. Oh, now that's not good for Bulgaria. Oh, that is so not good. Poland, uh, they're not doing great now. Oh yeah, they're definitely pushing into Poland. Awesome. Let's go ahead and do reconcile with, with KMT and Sij1. In the chaotic, chaotic world of Sijuanese politics, the officer department is the only group with a favorable view of the KMT. By supporting officer department in their provincial power struggles, we could gain a valuable ally or even control of their entire province through them. And that would be lovely. That would be great. Public support, more popularity, uh, that would be bad. We get more political power, but that's okay. Good. We're slowly winning here. Come on. All they are just men. And hold. Good. We made it. Oh, I should not have let you move. Good. They're attacking us. While we're trying to get militia divisions to move down here. Now we're going to push up through here. I know it's been like 15 minutes. And it's taken me a while to push through here. But that's okay. And we were taking a lot of losses just to do this. Which really sucks. But whatever. It's kind of a necessary evil. But we'll get slowly, slowly getting more and more artillery. Which is good. That'll make the difference between me and these guys. Oh my gosh. Switzerland. Switzerland. You've chosen a side. Oh my goodness. Syndicalist. Beautiful. 
Oh, we'll improve machine tools. Very good, very good. Let's grab some interwar artillery because, well, I need some more kaboom. Awesome. I don't know. Why do the Indians keep attacking like crazy? That doesn't make any sense. I want you to immediately attack here. You have enough divisions. Yeah, it's three divisions, but if we can, like, get to the river, that would be great. Yes, yes, yes. Uh-oh, what's going on? Tripolitania and Bulgaria. Oh, uh-oh. That's good. Well, we have more army experience with our general. 94% getting closer to level 5 skill. Uh, Li Li Zhu isn't doing great. They've thrown in maybe another division. I don't know, maybe not. 81% of the way there. Destroy that militia division. Militia divisions are so bad. Yeah, they can recover fairly quickly compared to infantry, infantry divisions, but... They're honestly a waste of manpower. I mean, maybe use them for coastal defense provinces, but I'd recommend not. Oh, someone else tired out or something? Good. Liberia. Nice. Liberia, you're doing a great job. Come on, give me more army XP. Grind it out. Hold. Good. Good. That's really nice. That's actually really nice. That defensive, that river will be great to defend against. Cool. We got a lot of uh, political power, too. War propaganda wouldn't be bad. I could use more stability. Rally public support. That isn't... Oh, my goodness. Immediately go to war economy. I can't go here. I need more war support. So, go to war economy. And then... Oh. Holy... What did I get this manpower? Oh, that's right. I did core some of these territories. So, that did give me so much more manpower. Oh, that's silly nice. That's so incredibly nice. We are slowly but... Surely winning this war. It's going to be very slow, but now we have a surplus, a tiny surplus of artillery. Less than a 2,000 gun deficit and support equipment. Oh, that deficit's going down as well. Ah, oh, greatness. Great. Look at that thing here as well. Take you off. Attack. Oh, they just threw in another division. We might not win here. Three. Yeah, it, we're not doing enough. Oh, the Korean Uprising. Nice. Republic of Korea declared war on the Empire of Japan. Great. You guys, let's get some more research speed. Awesome. Korea, I don't think you have your own focus tree yet. Yeah, you don't. I don't have the sub mod for the Korean focus tree on yet. That's okay. Oh, they're attacking the Kingdom of Hawaii. Join the Entente. Uh, yeah. Keep attacking me, guys. I like that. I like to see that. Three divisions here. Now, they do have a cavalry division, which isn't super strong. It's about, I don't know, comparable to my strength, maybe. Maybe. Oh, our capital's in Nanjing? I didn't realize that. That's that's a little dangerous, not gonna lie. It's a little dangerous. Attacking over the river doesn't really help too much, but we should be able to win here. Good. Oh, reconcile with the Camptean Sichuan. How about we reconcile with Camptean Yunnan? After the northern expedition, the remnants of the armies controlled by the right Camptean found refuge in Yunnan province. With the victory of the center-right Camptean Yunnan's recent power struggles, we may have a chance to mend the old Nationalist Party together and form a powerful front to unify South China together. That's right. Together, friends. Together. Good. We're slowly but surely winning. I love it. And Lin Biao became level 5. Even stronger. Oh. Please don't have holes in the line. We've lost 29,000 versus their 29,000. You can tell we're doing better now. I'm a little bit more optimistic now. Alright, so you're going to attack. Alright, well, let's make sure Nanjing isn't a frontline province. So be it. Break over the river if we can immediately. Just help them out. So that's another defensive area. And I might be able to encircle this area just a little bit. Oh, they don't like that. They're attacking me. Awesome. I could use a little bit more war propaganda. Let's do that. And greatness. Great. Great, great, great. Let's let our soldiers spread out a little bit more. Oh, actually, maybe that was a bad idea. Whatever. Okay. Indian guy. Guys, guys, please stop attacking. All that does is give them more army XP, which is something we don't want to give those guys. Um, all you guys, except for you, attack here. Let's get Bang Boo. Artillery, 20 pieces. Very good, very tasty. Sultan of Egypt declared war on the Ottoman Empire. Persia declared war on the Ottoman Empire. They went to war with Bulgaria, which now they're probably regretting. Rebellion in Yemen. Very nice. 
Very good. Oh, we might not be winning here anymore. Oh, they threw on four divisions there. Holy cow. Albania joined the Donau Adriatic. Go ahead and stop attacking. That's okay for now. Let's reorganize our lines just a wee bit. Oh, and they're attacking me again. All right. Good. Good. Nepal declared war. Oh. No, we lost our Indian division. No. Nepal, why? These are kind of fancy. They don't have a focus tree, which kind of well, makes sense. Why would Nepal have its own focus tree? Philippines joined the co prosperity sphere, so be it. Huh. We can do this. Get some. Maybe I'll speak. Burma joined the same group. Yemen joined the Cairo Pact. Everyone's, like, choosing their, you know, leaders and stuff. Or factions, I guess. If we have to attack, it'd probably be right here. Could you win here? You might be attacking over river, maybe not. <clears throat> uh oh, what's going on? The Street Kingdom joined the Cairo Pact. Declared war on the Ottomans. We're slowly winning, great. We're slowly becoming a trickster and a hills fighter. Good. How is the American Civil War going? Oh God, God! The American Union State just went all the way up to Minnesota. CSA is not doing well, which I don't like. See a little bit of a rebellion over here. And the federal government's still holding on. I'm surprised. Usually they hold out in the Midwest. But, uh, they're not doing so well now. But they're still holding on in the East. So, actually, that's not bad. That's really not bad. But, obviously, I want the CSA to win. Because it wouldn't be very logical for me to support anyone else but the CSA. So, there you go. Good. Still have a small deficit of infantry equipment and support equipment. So be it. Oh, they threw more divisions here? Interesting. Can we still win, maybe? If I threw you in there? Yeah, we still might be able to. With four divisions versus three, really two and a half, because that division's really weak right now, would we be able to win? Maybe not. Probably not. Well, we got rid of the Militia Division, which is nice. Ooh, Reconciliation with the KMT and Yunnan. Awesome. And I've done every single available focus that I can do currently. Which really, really sucks. So I could choose something else to do for now. Or save up my political power. Honestly, I could, like, do some of this stuff. Land Doctrine? <laughs> Dockyard output right now? Yeah, that wouldn't be worth it, though. Um, is there anything I can do here to change stuff? I could go for more population, I suppose, but that really doesn't matter too much. Change my minister? I can't really change that. Companies? We don't really have much here either. I mean, that's, that's good to keep. I don't like this too much, but I can't change it. So, really, getting more political power really wouldn't be worth it too much. And all I want is more civilian factories to build. Training time... I would like more output. I can't really get more output, so I'm going to save up more political power for now, I guess. So, there's really not much I can do about that. That really sucks. Good, you've broken through, you've broken across, Republic of Korea was annexed, they barely had a chance. Go ahead and hold. So give me as much political power as you possibly can now. And keep these guys in place. Yeah, no. These guys are going to get attacked, then they'll adjust themselves, which would be great. Alright, go ahead and hold. Let that militia division die against us. Awesome. 35,000 losses versus 48,000. I'm loving it. This isn't McDonald's, but, you know, I'm still loving this. They're on partial mobilization. Good. Let them attack us. Keep an eye on the artillery. And I'm going to convert one of you guys. You, if I can. Yeah, you're, you're not, Oh, you're a 19th combat with division already. Awesome. You are not... Oh, I can't, God dang it, I can't convert you. Ugh. Garbage. I can't convert you either? God, come on, man. Why do you have to hurt me like this? I can't convert most of you. Are you already 19 combat with? You're 20 combat with. It's not bad. Pao Bing. I really don't want to spend too much army XP. 97 soft attack versus these guys at just 91. That's, not actually, that's actually not too much more soft attack. Yeah, they're pretty comparable, honestly. Pretty darn comparable. Uh, they're attacking me here with even more vigor, which is fine. 
Let's let a little more. Let's get a little more strength first. Let them continue to attack us. Weaken themselves out before we counter attack. Happy 1938, everyone. Ah, uh, slow going here in China. It's very slow going. Good. They stopped attacking. Immediately counter attack. With the best divisions possible. Now you're surrounded on four sides: Portugal and Middle Africa. Subtle their differences. Good job, Middle Africa. Good job. 80. Come on. Delay. Yes, yes, yes. More organization. Let's get some more defense. 81. Good. 82. We should be able to win. The Shuki Kingdom was annexed. Go ahead and force the attack. I want these guys out now. Portugal joined the Entente. Great. Guns. Arti artillery is doing so much better. Love it. Support equipment is getting slowly better as well. Awesome. Good. And I will have to break over a river eventually, but not yet. Oh, they threw another division in here. That's unfortunate. Good. 77. Keep going, keep going. Oh, oh, oh. Now, I don't like doing soft attack or forced attacks. Oh. To lose too much strength. They can keep throwing them in there, but I'm going to keep defeating their divisions. Mm, you guys are doing okay. You know, I'm going to tell you to hold. I'm going to tell you to help attack now, too. Throw in a fresh division. Good. Doing better. We actually are making a few convoys. That's nice. Infantry equipment is going down. We're getting a ton of political power. Can I spend it on anything good? Oh, you know what? Let's go ahead and do this. Rally public support. That's fine. It's not like we really use consumer goods anyways. And we're not going to do that either. Come on. Keep defeating them. They, they cannot stand up to us. Level 5, General. And they're throwing that division back in there as soon as they possibly can. And they... You now click wishes to join our faction. They've approached us to join efforts in bringing the revolution to China. How should we respond to their requests? We don't trust revisionists. Or, of course, we welcome our friends back. Wait. You can see the event that left KMT has refused. They've become a puppet of us. And the Yunnan clique will be known as the non zhao Autonomous Region. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Look at that. Now that's wild. Hello. Zhao Xingwu. Yeah, buddy. Radical socialists. They're a democratic fortress. Oversized army. That's not good. They still, they're economically depressed. They got bank investments. German economic control over the, the people. Um, Kumun, Kumintang in power. Expand cynicization policies. Ooh. Monthly population. 100% for Chinese territories. I love it. Uh, I'm gonna, can I request guns? Can, can I have guns, please? No? How about, how about some artillery? Can I, can I please have? Nope. Can I have some forces? Oh, actually, yeah. Give me your forces. Oh, but I can't move through their territory, probably. Well. Eh, you know what? It's worth trying. It's worth trying. Um, I'll choose you, because why not? Can I ask for... No? God dang it. You know what? So be it. Just just march through their forces. Th through their lands, I mean. I'll keep them like this for now. But we'll see what happens. Good. Now we're doing pretty well over here. We have better artillery. I love it. Let's grab some improved infantry equipment. And we're attacking pretty much over a river now. This is going to be really bad. This is going to be terrible. Keep making more. Artillery's doing great. Bubbing Shi. Doing pretty well. If I had to attack... Can you guys attack this way? You can. That's not bad. Could you attack that way? You could. You could attack that way, too. Can you attack over the river this way? You might just be able to. Force the attack. Quickly do it as fast as you can. You're going to hold there as well because you're not a great division. This does stretch out our line just a little bit more. Whatever. Totos and the Barty are coming. You know what I'm going to do? I want to train you guys. I want as much army XP as fast as possible. Actually, that's not a bad idea. Nice. From army exercises. Yeah, it's not much. But I want to get rid of our penalties as fast as possible. <clears throat> Come on. We still get a good amount of political power today. 1.93. That's awesome. Come on, guys. Give it your all. Give it your all. Break across the river. Six, seven. I want you to immediately move that way. 
the committee's own. Get to Yang Chang if you can. Great. Guns, not bad. Artillery, not bad. Immediately counterattack. And get to Yang Chang if you can before they do. And circle. Oh, we did it. We did it. Awesome. Now, they still get a lot of supplies over here, but that sucks. That's okay, though. Let them think that they can win for now. Let them think like that. Doing okay with get, doing more exercises. We've got plenty enough factories. Maklik is destroying Mongolia. Support equipment deficit is going down even more and more and more. I love it. Good. Continue army reform. Oh, there we go. Mobilize NRA militia units in Anhui. Let's do that. Integrate the Nanzhou Autonomous Region. Ooh, we have to be a neighbor, though, to do this. Oh, we are a neighbor. For 50 days. They join the left KMT. And, oh, oh my god, yes, I have to do that. I have to do that. Good. Keep moving soldiers around. Liao Zongkai dies. Earlier this morning, in the company of his family, the KMT veteran and revolutionary hero, Liao Zongkai, passed away in his sleep. Many of the leading figures in the KMT attended his funeral, including the current KMT leader, Wang Jingwei. While KMT members are mourning his death, Wang Jingwei encourages KMT members to carry on Liao's legacy and continue the struggle of his revolutionary career. Ooh, radical socialism goes down. No, I don't like that. The fall of... Ah, oh, Warsaw, that, there, there they go. And there goes Poland. Oh, Poland. Revolutionary Republic of Honduras joined the Revolutionary Front. Okay. Why don't you guys to attack now? Give it more strength. More power. And then you'll move immediately down south. Because I need that tile and Nong Nantong. So I can take out the port and then encircle, destroy these divisions in there. Great. Or at least destroy that group. Says you want to join the north? Zilik. Oh. Northern Z Oh, that's not good. I don't like that. Stop it. Stop it, you all. Dis oh, destroy the isolated warlords. Hmm. Well, hopefully they don't come for me or my puppet first. Hopefully not. Mongolia was annexed. Alright, so be it. You know what? Kill these guys off. If you can. Because I can encircle these two divisions, which will make things much easier for us. Good, we have that out. We can immediately move in and destroy these divisions then. These guys will get no supplies here. As long as we win. Come on. There you go. Good. No supplies for these guys. Awesome. And my god, it's becoming a little bit laggy. And that's okay. Good. Great. Destroy these guys immediately. RDP takes power in Bulgaria. So be it. So be it. That's fine. Who cares? I'm surprised they're not trying to attack me to rescue their soldiers, but that's okay. Oh, we have less than a thousand gun deficit. Integrate them. Uh, yes, please. After 50 days, I gotta keep an eye on this. I'm gonna return the armies, their soldiers to them before they're done. Oh, good. More units. Three right there. You are gonna be led by Zhu Zheng Cheng. Chen. Chen. Something like that. Great. Oh, look. Focus on these guys down here. Once these guys are dead, awesome. Kill these guys off, please. They do not deserve to live for this. No. Finish those people off. Please attack Sish. Oh wait, you're not going to attack Sish one. Take out Hunan or something. Or attack. Yeah, attack Mukleek. Yeah, guys, attack Mukleek. They don't deserve to live. It, well, I mean, they are an illegitimate republic. Yeah, awesome. Now you guys. Attack Nantong. And we'll destroy that militia division. And then we'll have one big old front to the north. And we might be able to push these guys out. We might be able to. Keep an eye on integ integration. El Salvador joined the people's vanguard. Very good, very good. More propaganda. Save up some more political power since we want to integrate provinces anyways. Great. You know what I'm going to do? Here. Who you guys, I cannot change your thing. Um, this is probably isn't not a super great idea, but I'm going to put you all under him. Because for the most part, I want to be able to change everyone's template if I have to. So this is actually better for us. 
Good. Get to the front. Continue army reforms. Produce more soldiers now. Boo bing she great. Artillery's doing absolutely great. We don't have as many guns as I would have liked. But that's okay. We're rallying public support. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah, once these guys get here and they have enough planning bonus, I will attack in the northeast. Yeah, Karas, the river, not a good idea, but whatever. Come on. You know what? Go ahead and start attacking. All but one attack there. Good. They shouldn't be able to hold us back. Awesome. Then you three, you just move right there. So we can circle at least two divisions. Maybe three. Perhaps. Good. They're attacking us like crazy. Good. We've destroyed 135,000 of them versus 40,000 of us. 29 days. Good. Another boobing. Great. Yeah, keep trying that, guys. Keep trying that. They're still trying to attack me. So be it. Give me that army XP. I really hope they don't go for us. Oh, they didn't go for us yet. They're not justifying on us, which is good. They probably have a decision to take for them to actually do that against us. We're still building up civilian factories, so be it. And... We're almost there. We took it. Kill them off immediately. Three enemy divisions shall perish here. Oh, good. They're dead. Why did you abandon that tile? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Great. Immediately attack. You know what? You got six divisions there. Help attack. Be careful when you attack. Like that? Yeah, that's not a good idea. Here might be a good idea. El Salvador, awesome. Awesome. Oh, you actually won there. Oh, yeah, that's not over a river. That's, that's why. Good stuff, good stuff. Over two political power a day because we're not doing a focus. Awesome. Let's go and stop training. I need as many guns as possible. All right, I believe I clicked. Yes, good. Where, why is your supply so bad? You know what? You all do that. Because supply I know is terrible here. Give me half of you guys. Focus like down here or something. I don't want to refit you guys with stuff. But you know what? If I'm not using you, you guys can go go that way. Good. Can I win here, maybe? Oh, if I can win there, that'd be great. Still not as much as many divisions as I would have liked, but that's okay. Cool. Be balanced. Be more aggressive. And screw the aggression now. Just just go. Just go. We may have a gun deficit, but that's okay. Good. Good. 200,000 men lost for the enemy. We've lost 50,000 or so. 42,000, not bad. Pretty nice. Five more days until we can integrate them. Good. Argentina was annexed. Oh. Not bad. Pretty good. Patagonian's workers front. Awesome. Oh my god, the CSA is really not doing well. Oh, here we long. Please stop your assaults. Oh, and Poland's back. Oh, they're even weaker than before. <clears throat> Beijing, what the hell are you doing? Guys. You're not getting any of this. You realize, Beijing. Declaration of the Argentine Commune. Like, I've done all this work. You don't deserve a single tile of this. You basically just kind of backstab these guys. They trusted you for so long. Ugh. I haven't seen them take a single tile yet. Chile joined the Third International. Great. Great. Come on, come on, come on. We gotta hurry up before they do anything. Jinan? They're, they don't deserve a single tile of what we just did. Yeah, you went to war with them. Big deal. It doesn't matter. This is my territory now. If you don't like it, bring it on. Awesome. And we have more factories. Thank the Lord. Oh, look at the supplies we have. Look at the supplies. That is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. It's so beautiful. I might consider making some interwar fighters now. But the resources are really good as well. Oh, this is so good. So good. Um, fighters? I like bombers too. But we do any more... Eh, we're doing pretty well on all this stuff. Hmm. We'll do that. And we will choose one more focus. Great. First, repatriated Congress of the KMT. 
After a decade overseas, the Central Committee of the KMT has returned to China in triumph. Now that the initial war against the Nanjing clique is complete, the KMT has enough breathing room to reorganize and plan its future path towards national reunification. But that will have to wait until tomorrow, my friends. For today, this episode is over. So guys, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. I have more territory. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you all tomorrow as we shall continue unifying the rest of China. Thanks for watching, guys, and hope you have a great rest of your day.